Time is 741. If you missed it 10 minutes ago, sorry, don't mind the paper. This is very rude of me. This is the face finally revealed of the new host, the only host for the brand new show, Bachelor Canada. Tyler Harga! Hey. Wait a minute. Oh, double, double layer. How are you? Congratulations and welcome. Thank the you. The secret is finally out. It's it so is. refreshed. You it must have been tough to shoot. You pretty much shoot the whole thing, and, and you know, and you know what's happening, and you can't tell anybody. I can't tell anybody. My parents don't know where I've been the last two months. <laughs> so it's, it's, uh, Mom, I'm okay. They I'm going to be okay. And you've been doing this TV show thing for what, like 16 years? You are a veteran in the biz. Uh, yes, I, I think it's more like 20. But uh, it's, yeah, it's been a long time. Junkyard um, Wars. Junkyard you Wars, traveled. guests who's coming to decorate travel shows, Miss America. I mean, just a, you know, a little bit of everything. But yeah. I, I got to say that the Bachelor Canada, when they they came to me with this with the idea of doing it, couldn't have been more excited. Okay, so were you a fan of the original Bachelor and Bachelorette sure, show? So you were sure. very familiar with Chris Harrison's role. Yes. So you know you're going to get the comparisons. It happened to me with Nick Cannon, yeah. and it's like he's a guy and I'm a girl, and I got it. Yeah. So you're obviously going to get it. So how did you differentiate yourself, and did you have to practice saying? This is the final rose. Yes, uh, I had to talk about this is the blatantly obvious <laughs> final rose. You know, it's like I, I, tr I joke about it every time when we shoot Good. it, but uh, they always go, "Can we do that again?" Yeah, Just, clean uh, take. Yeah, um, it, it, it is. It's it's kind of become part of the show, so you kind of have to do that. But um, for me, what I tr I've tried to bring to it, uh, everything I do, I try to is always peppered with humor. And I think that's what's been missing in the, the in the American version of the show. Whether or not that gets on, you know, gets on tape, you know, or makes it makes it to the show, I have no idea. But you know, there's my role is to be, you know, to be funny, to be serious, but to be Brad's wingman. There's basically. Brad right there and there doing is. one of his functions. Doesn't he look fabulous? He's oh, amazing. He's handsome, that Brad. Yeah. So what do you think of Brad? I think Tell he's, us the truth. I, I, and, and this is the thing. He's, he's young for a bachelor, because usually bachelors yeah. are in their early 30s. He's 28, but I got to tell you, um, his, his maturity defies his years. Because he's an he, old soul. He's an old soul. Um, you know, he's sweet, funny as H-E double hockey sticks. I got to <laughs> tell you, he's a, he's a very funny kid. He's uh, engaging, but very, you know, very soft, very serious at the same time. Um, and he's just, you just cannot help but like the kid. He's, he reminds me of my best buddy who's like the guy that he can say stuff at a party yeah. to women that I would get slapped for. But for but him it's charming. They're like, oh, isn't he sweet? Brad, so, stop So it. that yeah. said, yeah. does he find love? You'll have to tune oh. into The Bachelor Wednesdays at 9.30, uh, leading good. into uh, Modern From Family. From Modern Family, yeah. yeah, that's quite the lead in. It is, yeah, we're very happy with that. What are the batch of girls like? Because we all know we love to see the girls vying for the guy's affection. Inevitably, there are some cat fights, there are some yelling matches. Oh, yeah. What's the deal with the girls? Great bunch of girls, beautiful, fun, engaging, um, and catty. Yeah, catty. Ab absolutely. I mean, you can't get that many women in one room and not have, you know, a little bit of, you know, competition. And I mean. there is the same setup in the sense that the backdrop is within a mansion somewhere in Canada. Can somewhere we say can where it's, it's filmed? The Bay of Fundy. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And there's a lot of fundy happening at the There's Bay of some fundy, yes. And this mysterio, this mysterial, mis mystical. The, the Bay of Fundy is basically the hot tub for the show. So, wow. Yeah, lots of fun things. And happen. is there a ton of travel as there is in regular seasons of the American version? Absolutely. Uh, going to all sorts of amazing places in Canada because we have amazing Wild dates. places to go to, yes. Adventure? Uh, <laughs> A lot of adventure. Really? I'm not, I'm not gonna. I, I can't. Obviously, can't give you too many details, but it is. You guys are gonna be really impressed. I know everybody thinks, oh, it's the Canadian version of a show. I'm gonna tell you this. This show is going to be amazing. You're gonna look at it and go, it is as good, if not better. Well, congratulations to you. Congratulations to the show. We cannot wait to watch it. As you mentioned, kicks off this fall. Thank you for being part of the fall launch. Thank it's you. Wednesday nights following Modern Family. Like, does it get any better than that? So 9.30 p.m. at Bachelor CA or follow Tyler at Tyler Harcott Double T as well on Twitter, correct? Yes. The host of Bachelor Canada finally revealed. Will you take this cup of water? Yes, I will. I don't know what this means, but cheers. Oh, oh. <laughs> It's a host oh. love connection of sorts. Yes. Cheers to that. Cheers. Just stay off BT, okay? You're too good at this job. Watch right the now, show. Right now, Melanie in the newsroom. You already got enough kicks.